Here we go with another day to show you another amazing technological innovation and advancement happening in China. So if you are here to watch some of the most amazing latest technological advancement and innovation taking place in China, then this video is just for you. Hi, good day to everyone. Arthur is back with something amazing to show you. So don't forget to subscribe and push the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our great contents. And without further ado, here we go with our video. Number 1 is Chinese Air Taxi Aerial Firefighting Vehicle. Chinese air taxi maker Yi Hang launches its first large payload intelligent aerial firefighting vehicle capable of extinguishing high rise fires. The autonomous aerial vehicle has a maximum working altitude of 600 meters. It uses a visible light zoom camera to identify the location of fire. The 216F can carry up to 150 liters of firefighting foams and 6 fire extinguisher bombs in a single trip. Multiple 216Fs can be deployed to rapidly extinguish the fire. Number 2 is Robots Rule at Beijing Expo There are more than 700 cutting-edge robots at Beijing's World Robot Conference. The coolest one? The Real Transformer. During the five-day event, exhibitors hope to showcase their product's great potential. These robots can be used for a wide range of purposes, from logistics, entertainment, to medical and security. China has been the biggest market for industrial robots since 2013. Demand is high for service robots and robots for special purposes. Number 3 is China's Man Deep Sea Submersible. Research plans for China's latest domestically developed manned submersible, Fan Doujie, were unveiled at the handover ceremony in Sanya City, Hainan Province. Fan Doujie completed its deep-sea trial missions, setting a new national record by diving to a depth of 10,909 meters. During the expedition, Fan Doujie completed 13 dives, including 8 deeper than 10,000 meters. Number 4 is China is leading the AI technology in the world. In 2019, the US technological think tank Center of Data Innovation published a report that reveals that artificial intelligence or AI is applied in 32% of Chinese businesses. In the US and the EU, the application is 22 and 18% respectively. 
Technologies such as image recognition, object tracking, and autonomous driving are entering every Chinese industry. China's AI market is expected to reach 11.9 billion US dollars by 2023. Number 5 is China's second 10,000 ton class destroyer. A Type 055 large destroyer named after Lhasa, the capital of southwest China's Tibet Autonomous Region, recently made its first public appearance at a naval base in Qingdao, East China's Shandong Province. This makes the Lhasa the second type 055 destroyer that has entered service with the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy. Number 6 is China's Mega City Cluster Defense Coordination. China initiated a key strategy in 2014 to coordinate the development of Beijing, Tianjin, and Hebei province, a regional city cluster called Zhengjinji. In seven years, notable results have been yielded. Beijing's technology hub Zhongguangkun has become an important engine for scientific and technological innovation in the city cluster. Number 7 is World's Longest Steel Concrete Bridge The world's longest steel concrete composite cable state bridge, the Chibi Yangtze River, was successfully joined together in Chibi City of central China's Hubei province. The main body of the bridge is 1,380 meters long, with a main span of 720 meters. The two-way expressway on the bridge has six lanes at a designed vehicle speed of 100 km per hour. The bridge, which is expected to open to traffic, will shorten the traveling time across the river from 2 hours to just 5 minutes. And that's all there is to it for today. Once again, this is Arthur. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.